This video camera was found deep in the catacombs. It was picked up by a catacomb explorer, some of the people who wandered down there. It was given to me, I looked at the tape. It's very bizarre. It has been said, if you follow the deepest and darkest tunnels in the Paris catacombs, you will find the gates of hell. Dubbed as one of the scariest places on earth, the Paris catacombs is a massive labyrinth filled with tunnels and rooms, and most of all, bodies and bones. Along the tunnels and in the rooms, there are millions of remains of human bodies. These lower levels have been closed off to the public for decades, but new entrances are being found all the time. These tunnels are ancient and full of stories to tell. After many basement walls collapsed in St. Innocent Cemetery in 1774, remains from the graves were being transported to the mine shaft that we all call the catacombs today. About six million remains of humans are stored there, along forgotten in the 400 miles of tunnels and rooms. Many people have lost their lives exploring the catacombs. Once you run out of batteries or light, you're dead. Many people have gotten lost in the endless mazes, but this time we get to see the experience of one of them. A man was videotaping deep in the Paris catacombs, exploring tunnels and photographing rooms of bones and deformed skulls. His video camera was found deep in the tunnels by an experienced explorer and was brought to the surface for the public to see. But no one knows what happened to the man. After 40 minutes of walking in the footage, he starts to move fast. Then he starts running. We can hear his loud breathing as he continues to run through the pitch black catacombs. Through the video, you can easily tell that he is very frightened. He runs faster, deeper into the catacombs, and then all of a sudden, he drops his camera. As the video continues to record, we can see his feet as he runs away. The camera keeps recording until it runs out of tape. The man was never heard of or found. A 12-hour attempt by Francis Freeland was made to find the man and retrace his steps with the found footage, but it was to no avail, and they called off the expedition after they were running low on supplies and most of all batteries. It is extremely unlikely he made it out of the catacombs that deep and without light, but we may never know what happened to the man that was lost to the Paris catacombs. This is far too deep for an amateur to be messing around. He must have lost his way down some passage and died. Anybody can get lost in here. Anyone can get lost in here. I mean, imagine just running out of batteries on your flashlight. You're dead. You're dead. It's true. I mean, just look at this. You just you lose your flashlight. What happens? We're finished. We're dead. If you like this video, be sure to hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell beside it and select the box. This way you will be notified by any new videos. Thank you for watching.